at first. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm laughing. It's just that I thought of something very funny. It's about a 90-year-old clarinet player. <laughs> uh, can we do this bit again? I didn't know Roland Blair was 90 and could play the clarinet. <laughs> that was the uh, funny bit I was talking about before. Uh, we'll be momenting more in the back. In the universe, drinkers and non-drinkers, sober and not sober, current affairs hosts and not current affairs hosts. I don't know. Some time ago, on another current affairs show in a not too distant television station, a man whom I will not name for ethical reasons, let's just say he's a not too distant relative of Terry Willisey, <laughs> filled in for the regular compare of that show, who for the sake of protecting her identity, I will call Yana W, pronounced we in Eastern European countries. This man came on air in a condition which, to say the least, was very, very strange. He said he was sick, and personally, I think it is sick. He um, he yard, he dribbled, he giggled, he slurred, his eyes glazed over, swung in his chair, couldn't even read the auto club. Cute. <laughs> All a sad indictment of journalistic integrity. You know what the saddest thing about the story is? The next day, the television ratings on that same show doubled. And I... Hey, David, is that true? They double the next day? Good. Jesus, wept. You're kidding. <laughs> How many, 20 points? <sighs> I don't hunch. I'll be back in a moment. 20 points, you've got it, don't you? Yeah, yeah. When exactly would Jana be back? Uh, we'll be back in more in a moment. Technical problem. Coming up soon, the story of a pederast who performed hair transplants on young children. But first, <laughs> I'm going to scull an entire bottle of tequila, some cream of month, and some of the blue one, and then some of the pink. And I'll tell you this right now, right here, that from me, Hunch, Darren Hunch, Hunch by name, Hunch by nature, I wouldn't be the least surprised if you got really disgusted, really offended, and rang the seven switchboard. Ring it now, the number's on the bottom of the screen, there it is. Or if you're in the country, try the toll-free number, appearing below. Or maybe if you told your friends about it tomorrow and told them how disgusting it was. That's how disgusting it's gonna be. I'll be back with more in just a mouthful.